What's going on everyone? It's time for another Horror Pack unboxing video. Today we're going to be unpacking the Horror Packs. So we got the book, which is where you get four Blu-rays or four DVDs. Um, yeah, for a, a certain price. It's like 20 bucks or something a month. And they send you them. They're new. You keep them. All that fun stuff. Uh, this one... I at my parents' house, so I kind of don't have much iPod, so I have to hold the camera. So it might be shaky and a lot of weird movements than usual. But uh, yeah, so let's dig into the horror packs for this. So you can buy either or. Um, the D I get both because each one's different. You don't get the same movies in each one, so. Uh, yeah, it builds my collection more. <laughs> so, yeah, I just cut them open. I never actually looked in these yet, so, so it's easier to, um, dig into them when I, uh, while we go through them. So, uh, yeah, but also one other good thing about the Horror Pack is that in the Blu-ray ones, there's always the Horror Pack exclusive, which is, like, a movie that's never either, that's either never been put on Blu-ray or it has, like, extra features and signs, sometimes it's in a steel book or some sort of collectors that's the main target is for film collectors for those and uh yeah there's a lot of cool stuff hit miss things always but uh yeah so let's get into it this isn't sponsored by horror pack by any means by the way this is just me uh i just like supporting companies i like so let's look in and see we're gonna start with the dvd one um yeah usually these are indie films and things so let's see what we got so the first one is Ooh, the siren. This is actually on Shutter right now. Um, but yeah, I don't know too much about it. I think it's like um, an evil, uh, what do you call it, mermaid type film. Uh, but you never know. But yeah, it looks pretty cool. It won a lot of awards. I never actually seen it. This looks. This is actually pretty short. It's only seventy nine minutes long. But yeah. So that's cool. It's probably like a, some sort of creature feature of love film. But yeah. Um, so DVD number two is In the Trap. This looks like your typical paranormal. On the back it looks more like a demonic possession type film. Which is neat. Uh, definitely looks like a higher quality. It's from Dark Sky Films. I haven't seen stuff from... I haven't got anything from Dark Sky Films in a while. I don't want to like put out like probably the best version of Henry Portrait of a Serial Killer and stuff so yeah definitely an interesting one so in the trap is number two number three we got from the dark this looks like a, a creature feature you can see the creature right there um yeah it looks like an indie version of the descent but yeah another cave dwelling monster film this is hard to do with two hands so <laughs> well one hand sorry but yeah and then finally the last dvd for the horror pack for the month of uh april is the disappeared evil is among us so yeah there's that that looks like quite the indie gem <laughs> um yeah it's an atmospheric thriller it says so yeah, who knows? I haven't never heard of this. This looks really interesting and odd. Um, but yeah, I think it's like a depressed kid going around killing people or something. But yeah, quite the unique selection for the DVDs. Um, yeah, so you got your psychological thriller. Let's just say that's that. You got a creature feature. It, yeah, and then you got your paranormal demonic possession style film. And then finally, you got your know, love uh, creature feature style film. I think this is like a darker version of like something like Twilight-ish. But yeah, and that. So that's a unique little collection that they sent. So that's the DVDs. Let's go into the Blu-rays now. So yeah, so let's see what we got. So the first one is The Final Wish. This looks like a pretty interesting paranormal film. I've heard of this. I've never actually seen it. But it's from the makers of like Final Destination and the uh, the chick who's in Asidious, Lynn Shea. Yeah. Tony Todd appears in this too. A lot of big stars in 
or icons and stuff in this. Sorry about the glare. Um, also, I do get comments that uh, <laughs> it looks like these are back. The covers are backwards, but it's just the way I record. I'm just too lazy to go flip everything and <laughs> so it's proper. So, yeah. But yeah, so that's the first Blu-ray. That's your, that's like a paranormal type film, I believe. Number two is the Horror Pack exclusive at number 70, which is called Death Cast. So this is like an indie slasher film. It was released back in 2021. And uh, I've never seen it, but I heard about it. And uh, it's from, originally from High Octane Pictures. And yeah, so yeah, that's neat. This is like your micro budget horror slasher so yeah that's the horror pack exclusive so this is the only type time you'll get like this on blu-ray as of now anyways and that sounds like the case is broken but yeah anyways <laughs> next one number three is oh wow i haven't seen this movie in a while uh it's called pay the ghost and it stars nicholas cage we got a good one this is before he goes all psycho crazy most of his films. This is where he tried to be more of a serious drama. This one was actually pretty creepy, I thought, when I first saw it. Um, but I definitely will love to relive it. I do not have this one either. It's one of the more psychological horror type aspects. Both uh, some spiritual stuff mixed together. So that's cool. And then finally, in the last one for the horror pack is... <laughs> I actually have this one, so but I got a second copy now. Full Moon High. This is like a horror comedy creature feature, somewhat like Teen Wolf, but it's from um, what's his name, Larry Cohen, the guy who did like Q, the Wing Serpent, and uh, It's Alive, the stuff. So yeah, this is on the tongue and cheek humor '80s horror films this one's actually really amusing it's been a while since i watched it but i definitely enjoy it and i have like i said i have this this is a scream factory release too which is great to see scream factory puts up great stuff and great blu-rays and everything but yeah that is the horror packs for april now also i'd like to apologize that uh this is going up really late this is like it's like May 4th, <laughs> and uh, but I live in Canada, and sometimes I get them later. So, um, But yeah, so uh, we'll just recap the Blu-rays quick. Um, yeah, you got your Full Moon High, which is like a horror comedy creature feature. You got your paranormal ghost psychological horror film, Pay the Ghost with Nicolas Cage. Um, you got your indie slasher. Death cast, which uh, looks amusing, and then you got another paranormalish psychological film, uh, The Final Wish, with a lot of big stars and stuff. So actually, this one isn't that bad this month. Uh, it's better than the last. I think it was the last month was terrible, but uh, wasn't that great. Uh, but this, they definitely upped it for this one. I'm a lot of these. I actually. We'll probably find interesting like the final wish um like i seen pay the ghost but in the trap and from the dark looks really good and the siren i hear is actually really good too so definitely an interesting collection and i only have one of them so another good horror pack so comment down below if you want me to review any of these in the future some or anytime soon so you hear my opinions on it and uh yeah also i'll link horror pack down below um so uh, you can check it out if it sounds like something you're interested in. And, uh, yeah, like I said, this isn't sponsored by them. I just like supporting companies I like. So, yeah, but that's what we got for, um, yeah, the month of April. So check them out. And, uh, yeah, and I guess uh, just make sure you subscribe so you hear my reviews on pop. Uh, so we find something weird, obscure, and odd like one of these movies together or... So you hear my opinions on popular films, classic films, and reviews on other things. Speaking of which, if you ring that bell, to, probably sometime tomorrow, because tonight I'm going to go check out a band called Nightwish. Um, so I'll have a review for that show, hopefully tomorrow. So make sure you subscribe and ring that bell and like this video. Share it so more people are aware of it. And yeah, comment down below if you want me to review any of these or your thoughts on any of the films that uh, have come in. So... That's it for this one. I'll see you in the next review, uh, next video, which is probably going to be a concert review. So, till then, uh, 
have fun, stay safe, stay scared, and I'll see you then. Cheers.